I wanna rock, rock. Dun, 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 I wanna rock, rock. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, all right, here from Planetary Lapidary, and I am once again on the western shore of Lake Michigan, my favorite spot, Rock Beach. Haven't been here a little over a month. Um, we had some crazy weather, big waves, lots of wind, huge waves today, and lots of winds, wind today as well. So. I'm gonna try my best with the sound. Um, I'm probably not gonna take much home today. I'm really just looking for a couple really yellow pieces and a couple really red pieces. You know, whether that be jasper or quartz or you know, whatever I find. Um, so let's get to it and I'll try to take some close-ups on the way, like I said, cause I'm not gonna really keep anything. So I'll try to get some close-ups on the way if I can. Oh yeah, no sun either today. So we'll see what we can do. Got some reds in there, and some blues. I'm gonna try to get away from the wind here. A little orange there, nice little one. All right, let's find some more. Just found this thing. It's kind of like two totally different rocks split right down the middle. Really cool, like basalt and quartz on this side, and like jasper and quartz, maybe calcite on this side. Kind of cool. Yeah, let's find some more. So, I see one right there, but I don't know if I can get it. We'll see here. It's a good time right now, actually. That's chromatoporide. Well, maybe with a little cold water patch there. Some fossil. It's pretty cool. Maybe a little pocket there. That's cool. Alright, let's keep going. I did just find this. It's probably just a granite with a lot of these like jasper red lines going through it. Really cool, um, but not quite red enough for what I'm what I'm looking for. So really cool, but not taking that one today. Alright, let's keep right going. Right there, I see one. But I'm gonna have to time it good here. Ugh. Okay, I got it. Yeah, definitely a stromat. Kind of a churdy one. Figured we'd find a few of these. Good shaped one. It's got that nice hole in there, but. All right, let's keep going. Not get soaked, this little guy. Had my hopes up for a second, but I think it's just concrete maybe with some red. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if it's a, uh, Man made something or other or not. I'm thinking it is though. It just looks cool. Alright, let's find three more little finds. Little churdies from Adiporoid. We have some algae in there. This is actually a really cool red and yellow. Probably just a granite, but it's just got a lot of red and yellow in it. And then this one was a really cool orange. Orange and black porphyry, kind of. Probably just a granite with basalt or something in there, but just really cool, cool to see orange and black. So I'm not gonna keep those two, but I think I definitely am gonna keep this one. Um, as long as those cross sections aren't super, super gritty, I might be able to get some really awesome pieces out of this. So definitely keeping that one. All right, that's one for today. So let's keep going. So we see a chain, I think. Yeah, right there. Yeah, nice piece of chain coral. Got some side views of the tubes there. Pretty cool, got lots of those though. But still cool to find them. All right, let's keep going. Two nice little finds. Nice little apple-sized chromatoporoid. Very, very churdy, almost entirely churt probably. You can see all those coital fractures on the top. But pretty cool. And then we found this little favocytes, which is really blue it's got a white line going through it. Just a really cool little piece. But again, I got a lot of these, so. All right, before we're spotted this. Pick it up. Oh, that's a really cool piece of quartz. Maybe some calcite in there. Oh, look at that. That is basically all mica, I'm guessing. Just a really big pocket of it. 
actually actually the white against the sun all throughout there. Look at that. It's like white, yellow, and mica. <laughs> all right, let's find some more. So a little handful of small stuff here, just a little chunk of quartz, piece of blue glass, and then just a pure piece of orange feldspar, I think, just all the way through. That's cool. Probably gonna keep the glass for my daughter. All right, forward. So I just found this guy. I think it's just a huge stromatophoroid, a really dark one. You can see all the layering and everything. It's just got really dark material in there. That's really cool. All right, let's find some more. I just spotted this monster piece of shirt. Oh, look at that thing. Got blue, yellow, green. Little pocket there of green, all this wispy yellow. Some more blue on that side. Really cool. Big piece of chart. Alright, so I found these two guys. Nice piece of porphyry with like some calcite maybe on there. Could just be quartz. Oh, really cool all the way around. I don't see much with the kind of orange stained on there. And then just a crazy little piece of chert. Got all sorts of stuff going on inside of it. Alright, onward we go. More little finds. Found a little marble. Blue and white and clear. It's pretty cool. And I found this piece of brescia. Um, you know, probably a brescia. It's really cool. The line kind of goes all the way through. It's really churdy, but still really cool. Just cool to see how Brescia, you know, breaks up and gets cemented back together like that. All right, let's find a couple this more. Guy, another old, big old chunk of chert, blue and gray. Sometimes it can look like there's some cold water in there, but it's just kind of the skin wearing off. But I like that color, the blue gray chert, chert, chert more little finds. A nice piece of almost pure jasper. Got some limonite stains, a little bit of quartz in there. Really cool. And then this stuff's all around. I don't find a lot of it, but this is a, just a piece of quartzite, I think. So, yeah, quartzite, not quartz, quartzite. Alright, a couple more. We're getting to the end of the beach here. If I find anything awesome, I'll show you. Stripes. I love those. I like quartz. Okay, so I'm at the end of my beach. Just found this guy. That's really cool. Just one like perfectly even stripe of quartz through it. Really cool just how that happens. All right, so we're going to walk some dry rocks on the way back, and if I find anything awesome, I will show you. All right, so I made it to the end of the beach, or, or back to the car, rather, and this is all I kept today. I kept that very first red and yellow. I found a nice quartz bomb on the way back to the car, and then two pieces of glass and a marble for my daughter. So all in all, we did find a lot of cool stuff. I just was looking for very specific stuff today, so I didn't really keep much, so... Hopefully you like this video. If you did, leave a like. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.